Hello all, welcome to Binary Programming. In this video, we will solve the fifth challenge of Developer Console Basics module of Developer Beginner. The name of the challenge is Execute SOQL and SOSL queries. Let's move to the challenge. So in this challenge, we need to write an inline SOSL search to return database values. So the very first step says that we need to insert a contact record. And in the second step, we need to retrieve the contact record which is inserted using the inline SOSL search. So both of these steps we need to perform using the execute anonymous window. And in the last step, in the debug log, we should be able to see the retrieved contact record from this inline SOSL search. So let's move to the org. So in the org, we are going to the developer console. And in the developer console, we are going to open the execute anonymous window. So the first step says that we need to insert a contact record. So let's copy this contact record from here. And we are going to paste it into the anonymous window. So here it is. So the contact record which we are inserting contains first name, last name, phone, department, title and email. So let's execute this query and insert the contact record. So the contact record got inserted. Now the next step says that we need to write an inline SOSL search. So if you go up in this challenge, you will be able to see an inline SOSL query which satisfies the requirement of our challenge. So let's copy this thing from here. We need to give some modifications in this SOSL query. First, let's paste this SOSL query into the anonymous window and later we are going to do some modifications in this query. So the challenge says that instead of searching for crisis, we need to search for mission control in this SOSL query. So let's modify this thing. So instead of crisis, we are going to search the mission control. So that's the only modification we are going to do in this SOSL. So what our SOSL is doing, it is finding the mission control in all the fields returning first name, last name, phone, email and description. Later we are looping through the search contact list and printing the last name and first name. So in the third point of our challenge, we need to make sure that we see the return records in the debug log. So in the anonymous window, we are going to click the open log. So after executing, this window will open up logs. So let's click on execute. So this is the log section which got opened up after we click on the execute. So let's filter this logs based on the debug points. So let's click on the debug only and we will able to see the found the following contacts Dent and Brand which we have inserted. So this is all. We have done the challenge. Let's see whether we have completed this correct or not. So yes, we have completed this challenge. See you guys in the next video with a new challenge. Thank you.